Hi, it's Jason Blackett back to share another cool customer idea that's been implemented for Zenworks 2017. If you take a look here, what I've got is the Zenworks Control Center. You'll see the new branding we're working on. This is one of the first builds that has that new branding that'll be there uh, by the time we ship. Uh, it, you'll see I've got a bunch of bundles. I can come in here and I can actually select a couple of bundles. I can choose Action and say Export Bundles. And it will go ahead and take those, export all of the metadata, as well as all of the content associated with that bundle. So in this case, there are a couple files. One was an install directory. One was an install file. It's going to take just a minute to bring that content down. And then we'll pull open the zip file. You'll see in the zip file now, we have the two bundles that were in there. Each gets a directory. Inside of there, we have the icon associated with it. We have any content, and then we have the XML data that if you're familiar with Zman, may have been something you were exporting. Once you've got that, you can go ahead and we'll go to JSON here. We'll say, I want to import the bundles. We can pick that bundle file that we had just gotten, say, okay. Now we'll go ahead and upload the zip file back to the server. And once it's up there, it will actually open up the zip and try to verify whether there are any issues. So when I click next, it'll verify if there are any issues. You'll see here, no issues, green status. It's also interesting to know over here, you have the edit bundle name column. So this is the name that you're importing. Let's say you wanted to call this something else. You can actually click in here and edit the file name. We'll click Next. And you'll get the summary page. It's going to create two sandbox bundles. Uh, actually, it's going to try to create them in that folder structure. Uh, so let's go ahead and back out here. Say maintain folder structure. And so it's going to create the folder, attempt to create the bundles uh, wherever those existed. And when you say next, it would go ahead and create them. Now it turns out that's not going to work for me because I've already got those. So I'll call this uh, JSON1. I'll call this one JSON2. So that'll be its new names. So now it's going to create JSON1 and JSON2. We'll click Finish, and now it's going to go ahead and create those bundles, and there they are, JSON1 and JSON2, but they have the same content as the original bundles. So what you just saw there, the ability from ZCC to import and export bundles. This is also tied in with rights, so you're not able to import bundles unless you have the ability uh, to author bundles in the system. Thanks to my engineering team, great work. Uh, you can. I'm really excited to get this feature in your hands um, shortly in a Zenworks 2017 beta build and eventually into the release product. Thanks. Mm -hmm.